Welcome back. The earliest known saddles were created thousands of years ago, so it might not seem like there's much room for improvement, right? It really does. <laughs> but a Dodge County saddle maker got a request late last year to make an adaptive saddle with one request that it didn't look like a wheelchair on a horse. All the way up under here. Whether it's conditioning. So what Jeep's doing is. Shining. Or sewing. The team at Emmett Saddlery can make or restore just about any saddle. What you have here is cowboy stuff. John Rafel is, is the owner. Cowboy. We don't do the new style. We do the traditional way. He's been at it a long time. Oof. I wore the clothes of a younger man. I I'm going to guess 40 years. So it's not often that his team is handed a new challenge. The other saddle makers would not take us on. But that's what um, Kay Nelson so brought him um, last October. And the gears in my head started to go almost immediately. Nelson needed a new saddle for her daughter, Sydney Mel. It's been more than two years. April 16th, 2022. Since Sydney got on a horse. I fell off of a... Um, uh, bunker silo, so like a wall, it was about 12 feet. A spinal cord injury left her paralyzed. I can't go up here. From the belly button down. It doesn't feel like I'm in a wheelchair out there. And that is the whole point. This is called a 40 Wade, meaning a 1940 Clifford Wade. The new saddle has a backrest, special seat belts for security, and magnets in the stirrups to keep her feet in place. It uh, brings a lot of com my confidence back and more independence, which I really like. It's appropriate. Sydney got the saddle on Mother's Day. It is my love. And um, what happened is after she was hurt, I didn't want to ride either. Rafel knows his creation didn't just give riding back to Sydney. We swelled, our hearts swelled. There were tears on my driveway. It gets the whole family back in the saddle. She has four legs now and they're moving and she is not in a wheelchair and she can do everything that we're doing. So it's, you know, priceless. And she and her mom are definitely planning some rides this oh. summer, but uh, Sydney's got a big fall ahead. She will be a senior at UW-Madison and she's studying dairy science. Uh, Emmett Saddlery also hopes that the design of this saddle sure. can help other people too. Oh, how could it not? Makes I mean, sense. Yeah, people see that that might have uh, you know a disability and like, well, I can do that too, right? Yeah. Um, and there's a really cool kind of thought process of how the mom said she now has four legs, right? I mean, yeah. when she's up there, she's like everybody else. I mean, she, the kind of the horse is an extension of her body almost. So it's I know. really cool. The whole project was super exciting. Yeah. Glad I got a chance Nicely to check done. it out. And uh, 